This room is back after a long, long time. Maybe because it was yes, it was available with Android 10, 11, 12 also. But maybe it's been a long time when they gave updates. But right now, with addition with Android 13, new update is out. The name is Extended OS. The previously named as MSM Extended, one of my favorite custom homes in the terms of customization. It has a lot of customizations. Not talking about this version, but yes, in the previous versions there were a lot of customizations. This is what we have based on Android. Android 13. Android 13 is right now is quite good if you compare it with Android 12 according to a survey. But yes, it's up to you, it's user's preference. The version, the custom home which we're talking about here is extended OS as I just mentioned. It has a September security patch and it might be available for your device as official or unofficial build. You can check out your device XDA or device telegram channel for more information. Let's just quickly take a look at some of the things which are included. For example, you can see the default launcher is not a pixel launcher. The things might be changed in your case if you're using unofficial version, but most of the things could be same here. If I move on to the things, as you can see, we have the all apps themed icons option there, which is working perfectly fine. So if you're using some of the apps which have the themed icon and yes, you want to enable that in app drawer, which sometimes look quite good, you can use that option. It also includes the double tap to double tap gesture, action toast, and etc. One thing which I got here is, of course, this might be bugged that developer options are just not working. But I think so. Most of the users just don't use this thing, so you can simply ignore this. One more thing which I've noticed here is, is in the recent panel. You have four options as you can see you have the clear all option lock option screenshot option which i think so most of the users use this thing i'm not sure but if you use this thing the feature is available for you you also have the clear all option and last but not the least i think so that option is the kill app so these are the options which are included in the recent panel quick settings panel as expectedly has a light background why i just don't want to use the dark background because it's just my choice because one one thing which let me just show you one let me just tell you one thing that dark background is not actually bad in my opinion what i just wanted to say is that if i want to use the dark mode then the dark the dark quick settings panel is fine but if i'm using the light mode i need a light mode quick settings panel because if i'm using light mode i'm not using the dark mode why i am using the quick settings in dark mode it's just my personal opinion i'm not sure what's about you but about yours but it's just my per personal opinion you can see the quick settings panel in this case is the light one so if you want to use a dark dark kind of quick settings panel you can use that by enabling the dark mode no issues in that if i move on to the settings ui in settings ui as you can see things are basically same no major changes but extensions is at the top which means our customization hub which includes some basic customizations and if you are into custom homes from a long time you probably already know that msm extended which it is previously named as was one of the most customizable custom homes and it was compared with the resurrection remix which is kind of dead for now but yes this was if i move on to the security section as expected it includes the fingerprint option for you which is of course quite necessary but unfortunately there is no face unlock if you're a user who love to use face unlock you had to disappointed and yes app lock is also coming very soon let's see when they will release but yes all these custom homes are coming with their initial builds whenever a room comes with some new changes i will definitely update you whichever room comes first i'll talk about all those things for sure you already know that this channel has almost all the custom home videos with their updates so i think and i hope you like these things if i move on to the theming section here comes some parts for example one thing which is quite good is for the amoled panel users if your device has amoled display and you want to use a pitch black theme it's there some theming options are actually quite good if you want to use other options you can or if you want to use a normal dark mode you can use that if you are dark mode lover including this dark theming option which is a kind of a lot of good kind of things it includes 
some Wi-Fi icon customizations. Yes, we, these are basically status bar icon customizations. You can use any one of these. You have signal icon customizations which are present here. But one thing which I have noticed here is in the font style. I'm not sure why though, but maybe if it needs a little bit of refreshment, I mean, if you just want to reboot my device or else because whenever I try to change fonts in first time, the fonts were changed. But second time, like as you can see right now, whenever I am applying any font style from here, unfortunately, it's not working. This might be a very minor bug because after reboot, this can be solved. But for now, even this is minor, this is a bug which we found. So yes, finally, I found a bug here. But this might be a source bug or this might be a very minor bug, as I just mentioned. So simply ignore this thing. You can simply reboot your device. Things might work for you perfectly. If I move on to the other options, including the steaming options, we have some animations related to power menu which seems quite good by the way whenever i have enabled any power menu animation like this slide and whenever i hold the power button you can see this is how the power menu is appearing if i use the 3d option this is how it is looking like i hope you are able to see that how these things are working it's just about customization i have already mentioned you some are customizations some are features this room actually has a, a lot of customizations compared to features some features are already present for sure but yes i'll i'll make a video on the features too if we move on to the gestures option swipe to screenshot as expected is already there some few of the customizations related gestures here and there right now with this initial build this room does not have all those customizations which were present with extended os version based on android 12.1 with android 13 as it is initial build let's see when they will release a lot of features when they will give you a lot of features which you were expecting in extended os for example if i move on to the status bar things it includes some bit of options bit of customizations for you like you can customize the volti icons the wo wi-fi icons if you want to wo wi-fi has the option for oneplus asus moto whichever wo wi-fi icon you just want to use on a status bar you can can. including this some of the customizations related to batteries some of the customizations related to status bar icons and yes all these things are already present you can customize these things if you want to it's up to you this is not a big deal including all these customizations which are present in extended customization hub we have some bit of things available to do theming i have already shown you the screenshots of all those things the default launcher and a lot more things as i just mentioned there might be some of the things available here and there for example if you're using if your device has the unofficial version things might be a little bit changed not major change but there might be a little bit of changes here and there so yes you can admit that one thing which is included is the ignore window secure flag so that whenever you want to take a screenshot in which the screenshot is actually restricted you will be able to take that which is a very useful feature this might be considered as a feature including that all those things i've already shown you these are the things which i just want to let you know about first look about extended os i've already shown you these were things which i just want to let you know i hope you like this video if you like this video don't forget to like and share this and also if you're new here if you're new onto this channel you'll see a lot of custom home reviews about updates and a lot more things so make sure to subscribe the channel and i will see you in the next video until then goodbye